It's designed to save your life if you're a passenger in a seaplane that crashes and ends up in the water. Viking Air unveiled a highly anticipated pop-out safety window this morning in Sydney. It's a feature some say could save lives. Last year, a Beaver float plane crashed near Saturna Island, killing six people on board. The Transportation Safety Board found the exit doors of the plane crushed on impact, and the passengers in the back couldn't get out. As A News reporter Louise Hartland shows us, the TSB says the new window could be a life-saving solution. Give a good push. Good push. With the pop of a window, Canadian aviation history is made. Salt Spring Air is the first airline in Canada to install emergency exit pop-out windows on a seaplane. Made a lot of common sense to further enhance what is already a very safe airplane, but to give my passengers an, a yet another way to get out of the aircraft. The pop-out windows were developed at Viking Air as a way for passengers to easily egress or get out of the airplane in case of an accident. David Curtis of Viking Air says the windows won't pop out mid-flight if someone is leaning or just looking out. So it takes a very distinct act by the passenger to push that window out with both hands. A simple solution to a problem that's had tragic consequences. In November, six people were killed when they couldn't get out of a Beaver float plane that crashed near Saturna Island. The Transportation Safety Board ruled the crash survivable. It found the doors of the aircraft jammed and its passengers couldn't get out. 41-year-old Dr. Carrie Morrissey and her baby Sarah both died in the crash. Her friend says today's news comes with mixed emotions. Well, it's, it's horribly upsetting to think that if it had been done before that flight that she could have made it out. Um, it's, you know, it's a, a done deal now. I'm really glad that out of maybe that time that more people's lives will be saved in the future. The Transportation Safety Board has been recommending the industry adopt pop-out windows for years, but it has never been made law. The board has uh, made recommendations as far back as 1994, and um, it's great to see the industry taking initiative to do that. Other airlines, including Pacific Coastal, Harbour Air and West Coast Air, say they will also put windows in their Beaver aircraft. We've decided that we will put them in, and again, anything to uh, help with safety on uh, our aircraft, we will we'll definitely look at. Harbour Air and West Coast Air say the windows will be installed by the fall. Each window kit costs $3,000 plus installation, but all agree it's a small price to pay for saving a life. In Sydney, Louise Hartland, A News.